protonated alcohols are the conjugate acids of neutral alcohols. And these are, of course, strong Bronsted acids as well as strong Lewis acids. They're great electrophiles at the carbon linked to the positively charged OH2 plus group. So, for example, we often see the dissociation of water as a nucleophuge or leaving group occurring at these protonated alcohol structures. So here's one involving what was terbutanol before protonation, loss of water in a D sub N step in which the carbon oxygen bond breaks towards oxygen, gives the tert butyl cation, this is a relatively stable cation because it's linked to three alkyl groups, as well as water. And so here we see that typical loss of water that occurs in protonated alcohols. And this kind of step can be a prelude to electrophilic reactivity of the carbocation. For example, this tert butyl cation can be attacked by a different nucleophile in an SN1 type process. Even when a stable carbocation can't form, we see protonated alcohols acting in SN2 steps, again thanks to the good leaving group ability of this OH2 plus group. For example, a halide anion can come in and displace OH2 plus in an SN2 elementary step. This establishes a new bond between the electrophilic carbon and the nucleophile, and again, water is kicked off as a leaving group or nu nucleophuge. Finally, the beta elimination of water as a nucleophuge can occur in protonated alcohol type structures where again there's another heteroatom linked to the carbon bearing the protonated hydroxyl group. So for example here we've got a nitrogen with a nicely nucleophilic lone pair positioned beta to the positively charged oxygen atom and adjacent to this polarized carbon oxygen bond heavily polarized toward the oxygen. And so we've got the ingredients for beta elimination here. An internal N to sigma star interaction results in the formation of a new carbon nitrogen double bond. Notice that the positive charge has now been transferred from the oxygen to the nitrogen. That's a plus in an electronegativity sense. And again, we see water being lost as a leaving group or nucleophuge. This is a key step in imine formation, which we'll see later in the semester. But again, because this intermediate looks like a protonated alcohol, at least if we center our attention on the positively charged oxygen atom, I wanted to include this elementary step here. If you want more practice with moving electrons in these elementary steps of protonated alcohols, check out these examples in the Mechanisms app.